so today I'm going to talk about how I set up my Emacs currently for my daily uh, writing and workflow. So here I'm uh, mentioning how uh, these days I don't have to look at my keys and I'll show in a moment how I actually achieved this. Uh, there are two things uh, here. One is that I set up my keys like Braille, like Braille as in Braille for blind people. And another thing is that actually it's also directional. So some of my keys like uh, some of my basic editing as well as uh, navigation stuff uh, uses uh, has a directional element to it so I explain in a moment what I mean by directional so here I'm also mentioning how I remap my H key on my Linux so as a result I'm actually struggling quite a lot in this video I type two keys Q and W together and how I how this is possible is thanks to key code uh, the key code package which lets you type two keys together and it will trigger something meaningful. So again, uh, the same thing with a uh, splitting window on the right, as well as switching between the left and right window, I also use key codes. So again, same here with uh, switching to previous and next buffers. So as you can see, my keys uh, uses uh, some Velcro pieces uh, to give that braille feel. But the problem with using Velcros is that it actually attracts quite a lot of, uh, uh, it attracts easily dust. And I'm, since I'm using the same setup for my laptop as well, uh, my ThinkPad actually I have to clean, I have to clean uh, more often. Most of the other uh, keys uh, were kind of important because uh, I use Hydra a lot, Hydra mode. Uh, the most important uh, of the Velcro pieces were the Control and Alt. So that was a no-brainer because you use uh, these two modifiers all the time. So I just put a small and huge piece of Velcro and I can almost use both of these without looking and one of the things I did not mention in this video is how uh, how I use my Hydra 
she used a semicolon and I use Hydra a lot actually so for most of my uh, basic editing stuff as well like uh, selecting a line, selecting region, even selecting a function as well as some actions on those uh, selected regions like uh, killing or uh, copying and then uh, pasting again uh, I use Hydra a lot directional which means actions that imply going back in time like undo or going to the left or previous uh, is paced to the left So same with the uh, uh, same with actions that imply going to the right. together such as splitting the window to the right and also switching between those left and right window are uh, three keys together they're all placed on the right but switching between left and right windows also has a directional feel to it so it's almost left almost right That's it for today and thanks for watching. Bye.